started when I was uh, querying agents. So I was going through the agents. I, I wanted to do a traditional, traditionally published book, and I wanted to get an agent and I, because I wanted to be a better author and illustrator. So I had queried um, Manny, had, had good luck, or at least some questions from a couple really good ones. And, but I was sending out a different book, a couple different books. Yeah. When I finally reached my um, now agent, but I didn't know that then, um, and I, I sent her the other books, two books I was querying, and she said, like them, but what else do you have in your portfolio? Well, I had nothing but a little thumbnails and an idea for Robot Zombie Frankenstein. And really, I was walking on the beach, and the words just kept following, like, Robot Zombie, Robot Zombie Frankenstein, Robot Zombie Frankenstein Pirate. Really no rhyme or reason. Like, I, I don't know. They just showed up one day ready for mischief, the two robots. <laughs> I sat at the computer, and I started drawing them, and I was like, hmm, so this is what you look like. <laughs> really. <laughs> uh, um, you started drawing them in quark uh, I with do. the mouse? I you do. I draw in quark, which is... Uh, a layout program. It's a computer program designed for layout, not illustration, used by old art directors who never learned illustration, <laughs> illustrator uh. or uh, Photoshop or InDesign, truly. But I was a master at Quark, and I like it, and so I'm comfortable in it. So if I waited too long to learn all the other things, I was afraid my books would never get done. So, uh. so basically, it's really easy, and I can show you that with, with the we'll, slides. Yeah, we'll sure include um, that. I can, I'll show you how to draw the purple robot in 15 easy steps. But basically, it's just taking a photo box.